Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tyne, welcome to my YouTube channel. So when you're trying to run Windows games on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac via Parallels, you might encounter a few bugs, especially visual bugs like you can see in front of me now. So this is Shadow Warrior running on Windows Arm on the Parallels Virtual Machine. And as you can tell, I am fighting invisible enemies holding katana blades and we have some graphical artifacts and we can't see our enemies. So it's a little bit bizarre. So this is what Shadow Warrior should look like. So this fix was brought to my attention by Discord user Bring Back Tron, and I'm going to show you how to do this on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac. So this fix assumes that you already have Parallels installed on your M1 Apple Silicon Mac. If you haven't installed it already, then please follow the instructions in the description. So all we have to do is go to the control center and click the settings menu. Then we go to hardware and then boot order here. And then under advanced settings, we're going to paste this particular line here, which I'm gonna leave in the description. And then all that does is bypass a certain buffer setting. And then when we actually run the virtual machine and the games inside, then the flickering issue in some games will also be fixed. I've written up full detailed instructions on the Apple Gaming Wiki website under the Parallels article. So please find a link to this in the description as well. So one of the most prominent games that has this kind of invisible texture or object issue is Valheim. So you can see here that when you actually move about in the game in uh, Parallels, you can see the trees are actually popping in and out of existence and even though we can't see this beech tree we cannot go through it so it's obviously affecting gameplay quite a lot. So this is what the game looks like after the fix has been applied and as you can see all the trees are rendering correctly there's no invisible objects or flickering textures here at all and this game is now completely fully playable on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac under Parallels. Similarly here in the game raft, we can actually see that the object flickering issue is so bad that we cannot see the full extent of what the raft looks like, which makes this game pretty impossible to play. I mean, if I look up from the sea here, we can only see two tiles, but the raft is actually much, much larger than that. So this is what the game looks like with the parallels fix applied. We can see the full size of the raft and there's no object flickering at all. And this game has turned from completely buggy into something that is completely playable now. So these three games are the only ones that I've tested for this particular fix, and I'm sure that there are more games which will be improved by this particular fix. So if you discover any new games which can be fixed with this method, or can be played with any other method, including Rosetta 2, Crossover, Wine, or Native, then please check out the Apple Gaming Wiki website for a full list of compatible games. So Parallels is definitely one of the best ways to run Windows games on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac. And if you use our discount code AppleWiki10, then you can get a 10% discount. Please also check out the Apple Gaming Wiki homepage and we are giving away one license for Parallels. There's only a few days left, so please enter now. The details are on the website. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.